How y'all doing? It's the bad just everyone. Chilling. Pool side. <laughs> yeah. It's beautiful out here. Yes, it is. And that sun is moving. See the sun right down here by my feet. So that sun is moving, honey. Yeah, it's gonna be right here. Yeah, sky's pretty and blue here in Las Vegas. And if you, um, this is my second stay at the Bellagio. Um, when I come back to Las Vegas, I think I'm gonna go ahead and um, have a third stay here at the Bellagio because it's so peaceful here. And they treat you like royalty here. I never had a problem with the staff. I never had a problem with anything here, anything. So, I mean, check-in is always smooth. Check-out was always smooth. Um, everything is always on time here at the Bellagio. So, um, I have really zero complaints about Bellagio at all. So, it's such an uh, iconic, beautiful hotel. Yeah. My daughter went back to the room right quick. We can get some extra money so we can get us something to eat food side. Yeah. I got liquor in my room, so I don't need to get the liquor food side. I can go to the box, go back to my room get me something to Get, get, get liquored up if I want to. <laughs> Shit. So you chilling. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. I these old vacations. Like to take a vacation every month. I would. <laughs> I, I really would. Yeah. For real. I said on my next trip, I'm going to bring my hubby. He couldn't come due to some other stuff he had going on. But hopefully next time I can bring my hubby with me. Um, so he can come on and... Um, enjoy the same sights and stuff that I'm enjoying. Me and him came here back in 2019 for like five days for our anniversary and it was the bomb. But, you know, he got some other stuff going on right now and uh, hopefully he can, he can um, come on our next trip to Las Vegas. So, yeah. So, yep. Pretty pretty. The sky. The sky so pretty and blue. Yep. So, just chilling for now. Cause yeah, we right now we just hungry. <laughs> we just want to eat. We want to eat. Yes. So, we with my daughter and wait for Brittany to come back down here. So, y'all lay low, stay out the way, stay safe. Cause some crazy people out here. Y'all, and if y'all come to Las Vegas, make sure y'all stay hydrated. Like I said on my video previously, stay hydrated because it is so, oh my God, it's so hot out here. It's still good now. Like I said, we got some water. And we got this uh, this umbrella up here. And we got this misting going on behind me. You see that fan right here? It's inside my cabana right here. So, but it's, it's, so, it's, it's so hot here. We were doing that strip yesterday. Oh my God. We was in the monorail. That's the funny part. We was in the monorail yesterday. We stayed on that monorail for about, <laughs> for about, oh my God, about five trips. Yeah, I said, I'm going to get my money's worth out this damn monorail. It was so nice and cool because we walked around for about an hour and a half in that sun. It was, it was horrible. So we did about five, six trips on that monorail. You know, go, we did the southbound monorail and then when they go all the way up and then they come back and then they tell everybody to get off. We didn't get off. We stayed on that damn monorail. Yes, we did. I was not playing. It, it, it felt so good. It only, it only sit and pause for about not even two minutes before it starts again. My daughter and Brittany was getting real nervous. They were like, oh my God, we stuck on this monorail. I said, no, we ain't trust me. I did this before. Yeah, I did it before. Don't worry about it. We sat there for a few minutes and it started moving again. Because I was like, oh my God, it was so hot. It was so hot. It was like 110 degrees yesterday or something like that. Then last night we went to a speakeasy. <laughs> they never been to a speakeasy before. Now I'm gonna do a video about that and what it was another YouTuber on here who talked about the speakeasy, but she failed to mention how much it actually cost if you want to stay in the speakeasy. It was free to go in there, but to stay in there, to see like live performances and stuff like that, I'm like the place wasn't even worth it. For real. It was it was it was a nice little more like a like a 1950s 60s type of speakeasy, but what they charge you if you wanted to sit there, I see y'all in y'all damn minds. It ain't even that deep for me. It ain't that deep. I'm gonna get back with y'all. Let me go ahead and just finish. Look, I have to live in the moment for real. I really have to. Yeah. 
Oh, here come my daughter and Brittany. <laughs> hey, hey. Aw. <laughs> okay. <laughs> cute, cute, cute. <laughs> all right, all right. I'll get back with y'all.